Now I can just remember a time when if you went to the doctor or chemist for a particular medicine, say for a headache or, or a cold, heavy cold or something like that, you got a bottle of liquid with a label, with the mixture, nothing else, just the <laughs> mixture, which meant that it contained more than one uh, actual ingredient. Um, now, and I want to just give some examples, a uh, few. Well, for the quincy, quincy, the roots of the corn bellflower will break the quincy, being soaked in, in cold water, drunk and retained in the mouth. For hoarseness, take the water aprons and St. John's words. Boil in pure milk, boil in pure milk, mixing butter therewith when boiling. Boil a portion thereof briskly and take for every, every morning and, 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 and evening. To induce sleep, poppy heads bruised in wine will induce a man to sleep soundly. My favourite recipe, though, amongst this lot is, is how to be merry. <laughs> now, if you would be at all times merry, eat saffron in meat and drink, and you will never be sad. But beware of eating over much, lest you should die of excessive joy. <laughs> <coughs> then um, one uh, very uh, something which had a lot of attention was impotency, and what they had for that was uh, take some birch twigs, soak in water, and drink. Uh, good cheap thing. Now one of the modern cures for cures for impotency is Viagra, but it is rather expensive. It would be much better to use just spring birch twigs and so in water. Now, cures for impotency are invariably listed uh, in, the, in, 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 in the herbals. I give um, uh, one other example which describes um, how to, they're quite blunt about it, how to incite lust when necessary <laughs> by using the, the, the rocket plant and seeds of rocket plant mixed with honey and applied as a poultice to the back will have the desired effect. Um, uh, but what was intriguing to us, and that I came across a, a, a thing uh, unrelated, um, um, there is a, um, a record saying that, and it's an intrigue one, that uh, the rocket plant um, was banned from being grown in monastery gardens, which is a bit, you know, what you make of that. Um, and by the way, um, you know, if you go to Morrison's and the salad counter, rocket is regularly supplied there. I thought you might just like to go. Now, that's it. Uh, the second one, herbal remedies allied to magical, religious, and superstitious practices. There are a lot of these types. And it's interesting that the original uh, works of Dioscorides, were, were, they, were, they, were, they were quite straight. There was very little kind of magical or religious or superstitious. But as the centuries went on, as it were, they, they became much more uh, common. Um, now, I want to um, give, give three examples. For the cure of uh, ague, that is malaria really, and uh, um, you, you ask the people, how are you now, say, and in the middle of ages, they might ask, how's your ague? You know, that's the, the type of thing. Um, it's a cure for, uh, now for a cure for, for ague is that, um, for malaria, which was at one time prevalent, prevalent in people uh, living along the edge of the Dabi, by the way, uh, such as Trevor, it was recommended to write on three apples, on three separate days, that is nine apples, the following. Well, the letter X Chai, which is a letter for um, Chai, Ol 
Onagla Pater, it doesn't matter. Then Chai Onagla Filius, Chai Onagla Spiritus Sanctus, that is Father, Son, and Holy, Holy Spirit, that's what it means. Um, and, uh, and what you do then, um, you Now, now I, I think I must have missed something up there. I'm see the following that right. Uh, I'm not quite sure what you did with the with the with the apples, but uh, I haven't got it down. <laughs> um, you must have kept them for a certain for a certain time. Well, um, for the Tusek, write on an iron nail the words Agla Sabaoth. Athanatos, that would have been in Greek, and insert the nail under the affected tus, and then drive into an oak tree. And whilst it remains there, the toothache will not return. Now, the most bizarre and incredible superstitious beliefs are found in, 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 in these things. And one of them is associated with the use of the mandrake plant. Um, but this, this doesn't, uh, funnily enough, appear in, in the herbal of the physicians of Malvai, which suggests that they may have been cut off in some way from general European uh, uh, practice. Now, the mandrake is a plant, a close relative of the, of the tomato. Uh, the leaves look a bit different, but the, but the fruit is very similar, the red in the, in the, in the tomato and kind of yellowish-orange. Uh, in the ma in the mandrake, um, I, it doesn't grow naturally in this country. Now, the mandrake plant has very well known properties. It is used as an aphrodisiac, a powerful al al analgesic, and was used to determine the sex of a baby. The first reference to mandrake occurs in the thirteenth chapter of Genesis, where there is a detail of account of how, of how it's used so as to enable Leah, one of the two wives of Jacob, to have a baby boy. Um, it is the mandrake root which has to be obtained and used. Now, the method used to obtain its root goes beyond the incredible and is described in many herbals. First, you loosen the soil around the mandrake plant using a silver rod and taking care not to touch the plant with your hands. Then you place a line or cord with a noose at its end around the plant, but taking care not to touch it by hand, otherwise the plant will scream. The other end of the cord you attach to a black dog, which is extremely hungry. You then place a piece of meat on the ground a short distance beyond the length of the cord which attaches the mandrake plant to the dog. The black dog, which is ravenously hungry, rushes to get at the meat, but in so doing, drags the mandrake plant out of the ground. The plant can then be handled by human hand. Now, this tail is virtually all herbals throughout the Middle East and everything. And in fact, it's in, um, and it, this is just a, 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 a picture I got of a, a, a herbal which was uh, uh, made in 1481. It, it's, uh, you can see it it, it Well, this is the, this is the, well, the man, or, or the, the man trick set out in the form of a woman and this is a little, this, this little black, black dog with, with, with a line which... Uh, um, so you have that as in, in, in one of the herbals, in the herbal of Apuli Platisini in 1481. Now you can find that, the mandrake everywhere. Uh, now, 